which this is when he told us because I'm telling them niggas like nigga we trues from the double block corrupt like nigga we don't know give a fuck about no trues <laughs> we gangsters uh -huh. so from there was trying but E was immediately like no mm -hmm. so I contribute that to E like because we was riders and they was riders and and once again the, the beefs that you had like with the dog pound uh, do or die for example out of Chicago um, these days those things are settled yeah. And sometimes men can hardly ever settle their problems. They they they, they hold grudges. Um, I saw something with you and Twister, of course, on a beef movie. Talking about the money kind of changed everything. <laughs> Let everybody mm -hmm. say, you know what? Let's be cool. Mm -hmm. But it had to be something deeper than the money. I mean, I just we just know we was real serious about if it was gonna go down, it was gonna go down. You got people in the industry really dying. Like rap music, the hip hop awards was. Any award show that was like the hood mm -hmm. in the streets, like man, do we gotta bring things to this? You know what I mean? Like it was, it was that serious, man. So if people start coming and talking like men, like if it ain't no real beef with you or like me and Twister, we talk. I'm like, nigga, I, I never listened to your music, so I don't know what you was doing. And he was like, well, you know, and it was just all mutual love in the end, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and guys that were saying we stole their style, you know, that was probably the biggest beefs that we had, you know mm -hmm. what I mean, with the do or die situations and all that type of stuff. But, like, even after time, because we went to blows with them, you know what I'm saying? But it was getting so serious that we had to come together. Then you had you had folks like, uh, what's this, mm -hmm. Farrakhan stepping in. Mm -hmm. Organizing all kind of rallies and cube and all them older guys was like, man, we got to, it got to stop. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So it was like a collective hip hop went from letting the media tear it down to the OGs stepping up like we can't have that. So it was like, we should, I think hip hop showed a real manhood.